guys, Katie here with Vapor Review, and today we're going to talk about Northland Vapor Company. Um, they sent me their e-liquid to try for you guys and to review for you guys, and I have mixed feelings about this. I have a flavor. I've tried two of the four flavors that they sent me so far. I have one that I really like, that I really, really like, that I can vape all day, and then I have one that I despise so much I don't even want it. So <laughs> we're going to talk about it. So let me start with one of the flavors that I tried that I love. That is this nuts and cream. Now I believe these are like $14.95 or $15. I'll put the link where you can buy them um, in the description. And then, yes, you get 120 mil bottles. So it's a lot. It's a bang for your buck, that's for sure. However, <laughs> there's one of these flavors that I despise and I haven't tried the other two. I'm going to try the other two with you guys. Um, but first I'm going to talk about the nuts and cream. The nuts and cream is very good. If you like your nuts, <laughs> if you like nuts and cream, uh, you like your creamy flavors and your, that nutty tone to it, then yes, you're going to really, really like the nuts and cream. I can't say anything bad about it. Let me take a vape. I got it on here already. It's very rich. It's very creamy. It's a medium flavor. Medium strong. These, it's very prominent. It's very, very much there. And it's not um, for you people who like uh, mild flavors because this is going to be more your medium base. But I actually really like this flavor. As you can tell, I have baked a little bit of it. So, yes, I recommend the nuts and cream through them. Now, I'm going to move on. <laughs> I'm going to talk about the one that I completely despise that I do not recommend and that I don't know why they even made this flavor. This is called Earl Grey Tea and I'm not even going to drip it because I know it's going to ruin my cotton. This is an intense, intense flavor. It reminds me of potpourri. Potpourri. I don't want to vape potpourri. So <laughs> with that being said, if you like intense, crazy flavors, um, that tastes like potpourri, <laughs> then you might want to try it. But honestly, I don't recommend it. This gets a fail from me, a big F, and that's hard to do. I'm so sorry, guys, but I wish I could like it. I wish I could find something positive to say about it. But I kind of want to ask, what were you thinking with this flavor? Too much, way too much, too much, too much flavor, too much. I'm not even going to drip it because it's going to ruin my cotton, ruin my cotton, guys. I've tried it once, and I... Literally, you can tell, I tried it, I dripped it one time, one time, and I was like, uh-uh, I had to change my cotton out. I was like, uh-uh, no. The smell of it, even. I had um, my friend smell it, and I had Clay smell it, and it's like, woo! This is like, it smells like something I would throw on around the house just to help with room freshener. It smells like room freshener, guys. I'm not even kidding. Now, I gotta admit, I've never had Earl Grey tea, so... I can't say that it is spot on for Earl Grey tea, so maybe you guys, if you drink that, you'd like it, but personally, I want it nowhere near my mouth or in my lungs or on my tongue, so hard pass. Hard pass on that. Now, that being said, I'm going to try their Pink Lemonade and their M3, which is a menthol melon. So we're going to start with the menthol melon. This is my first time trying this M3, and so I'll let you know. Let's see. It's okay. Um, the menthol is very light, so I definitely could vape it. If I had nothing else to vape, I could definitely vape it. I definitely taste the melons in it. Um, definitely not one of my favorites. I'd give it a C. I, I don't know. Maybe you menthol, fruity menthol lovers would like it. But personally for me, I probably won't touch this. So that's going in my C pile. At least it's not an F, right? <laughs> At least it's not an F. So let me try it again.
it's definitely vapable. It's not disgusting. So that's a plus. It's not disgusting. It's not like the Earl Grey tea that I think is outrageously disgusting and gross, and I could never recommend it. It's just not my cup of tea. <laughs> not for me. Not for me. This one's not for me either. Um, yeah, I give it a C. Again, I can't give it an F because it's vapable. You know, CD. I mean, it's not among my favorites, but... With that being said, that's a great winner. <laughs> that's a winner, right? That's a winner. Ding, ding, ding. All right, let's move along to the pink lemonade. Now, I'm going to say I have never liked a lemonade flavor. I probably never will. That is not something that I will ever flock to to buy or try at the vape shop. If I walked in and the, these were all lined up, I would have gone to the nuts and cream first. I would have smelled the Earl Grey and said, hell nah. And the menthol M3... Um, I would have, you would have said menthol, and I would have said, no, nah, no, thank you. Nah, nah, thank you. Nah, thank you. I don't want it. I don't want it. Anyways, but yeah, pink lemonade, again, is not something that I would normally vape. So let me burn this M3 off, and I'll put the pink lemonade on and give you a description. Okay, guys, so I just dripped the pink lemonade on my RDA. Um, it's very, very fragrant. It tastes and smell. Well, I don't know what it tastes like yet. I haven't baked it yet, but it does smell like pink lemonade. Actually, it smells like fresh pink lemonade, so we'll see. Hold on. Okay, so... I'm guessing for you pink lemonade lovers that this would be a big win. For me, I don't like it because I don't like pink lemonade. But I will give it to them. It is like drinking pink lemonade. So if that's something that you like, then you might want to try this. This is better than the M3 as far as being vaping, uh, vapable, vaping, vapable, vaping. Blah, blah, blah. This is better than the M3, but... Not by much as far as where I am concerned, as far as my profile. I wouldn't tell you to try this. Again, I would tell you to try Nuts and Cream because this is really a great flavor. They really did a good job. This is a B, a B flavor. Um, you know, their price point is awesome. I mean, you get a lot, but if you're not going to like it, then, you know, sort of what's the point? But that being said, I would purchase nuts and cream. Of the four flavors that I bought, that's the only thing I would buy. The only thing I can actually recommend to you, knowing that I personally like it. Now, like, like I said, if you like your melons and your mint, M3 might be your cup of tea. And if you like your pink lemonades, this is spot on for pink lemonade. So I'm not knocking their flavor concoction. I'm just saying it's not my preference. And it is better than the M3. And everything I've ever tried in the whole entire world, even Peck Vape Shops, guys, is better than this Earl Grey. This is the grossest thing I've ever been sent. And I hate to say that. You guys know me. I usually, you know, I can, I go off of flavor profiles. Usually, if it's not my cup of tea, <laughs> I keep saying that. I can't help it. I normally go off of what they tell me it's supposed to taste like. And if I taste those flavors, then yes. Even if it's not for me, I say, yes, this tastes like these flavors. And pink lemonade tastes like those flavors. Maybe Earl Grey tastes like Earl Grey. I don't know. But it is strong, guys. I do not recommend it. Do not rec rec recommend? I don't recommend it. I don't recommend it at all. But anyways, yeah, no, I don't recommend it. But I do recommend nuts and cream. It's a good flavor. But yeah. That's all I have, guys. That's their four flavors that they sent to me. I do think they have other flavors on their website. Um, I hate to give such a negative review, but, you know, it is what it is. I can't help it. <laughs> but anyways, all right, guys. Well, I'm going to go. I'll put the link in the description. We can go check them out and you can check out the other flavors. I will say their flavor profile is on point as far as uh, Pink Lemonade's on point, and so is M3. You know, I'll put the description and the links in the description so whatever anyways yeah guys don't forget to subscribe to my channel please i really appreciate it and don't forget to like and share this video that's all i have for you today talk to you later